Hi, and welcome to Legal Productivity's new tech tutorial video series. Today, we're going to talk about Evernote and how Rachel and I use this amazing utility to help us get our work done. Welcome to Evernote. The basic organizational unit in Evernote is a note. These are my notes organized alphabetically by title. Notes can be text, web clips, pictures, even audio files. Evernote organizes your information into notebooks. Here are my notebooks with the number of notes in parentheses. They can also be organized in tags. Let's take a look by showing you how Tim uses Evernote. Today I'm writing a new post for Rocket Matters Legal Productivity Blog. First, I create a new note in my blog post notebook. I call this post 7 ways to use QR codes. Now I'll start typing, adding links and images to the post. And Evernote automatically saves as I type, and it syncs across the web, your mobile device, and the desktop application. To further organize my notes, I add tags. In this case, I'll go ahead and add a legal productivity tag. Now I can access my notes by search or by tags. And that's it. Now let's see how Rachel uses Evernote to easily collaborate on projects. Like Tim, I use Evernote to capture information and draft notes. More often than not, I'm collaborating with coworkers and I need to share my notes. So Evernote gives me a couple ways to do that. First, I'm going to get my note ready. I need to send the new artwork for the law firm of tomorrow to one of my coworkers. And I go to the share button and I have several options. Post to Facebook, to Twitter, email, or copy note URL. I'm going to email it. Here I enter in the email address, add a note, and send it off. Now, the next way I'm going to share is through copying the URL. It's just copied the note URL, and I can send that to a coworker by pasting it and sending. And that's how I use Evernote to help me collaborate. We hope you found this tech tutorial helpful. Thanks for watching.